Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedient PC Auto Labs. Today we're going to keep working uh, on our video tutorials in which we demonstrate the newest features included on the latest version of Studio One 5.5. So one of the features we're going to be learning today is going to be the the new snap to event end option. Okay, so as you might know, uh, Studio One lets you snap your clips to different things like grid and things like that, but and you could also not snap to anything. You could just basically move the clips, starts and end, kind of like free floating mode. But they have added this new feature in which you can snap to the end of another event. And we're going to demonstrate that today. So here we have a loop track, which is an audio track, just a stereo audio track. And as you can see, it doesn't really end on a grid mark. It ends in between two grid marks, but it's not exactly, it's not a precise spot. It's just there you know then i have a synthesizer track okay which is a virtual instrument that ends on an actual grid mark but let's say that i wanted this to end where the loop does well i could go out of snap and try to click and drag to kind of match that but it's never going to be perfect so what do i do well uh, first of all uh, you could once again Try to do it by eye. It's not going to be perfect, but that's a, that's a way to do it. Or you could use the snap to event end feature. So once, uh, so first thing you do, you have to toggle snap on. So that's blue. You can click to toggle it on and on, on and off. If it's blue, it's on. If it's gray, it's off. So it has to be on. And then from the snap menu, you want to make sure that you have snap to events on and then snap to event end on. You don't necessarily need the grid in this case because this is not actually on a grid. So if you have snap to events and event end on, you're good. So now you can simply go ahead to the end of that synth clip that I have. It's a virtual instrument and I can just click and drag that clip. And once it get close to the end of the other event, boom, it snaps to that. Once again, you click and drag the end. And once you get close to the end of the other event, the one on top, boom, it'll snap so that now uh, they both end at the exact same location and you are making sure that they have the exact same length because they both started at the same place. So that's the snap to event end feature included in the latest version of Studio One 5.5. If you have any other questions, please call us from Obedient PC Audio Labs and we'll be happy to help you. We will see you soon. Bye-bye. Want to learn how to produce music using this or using that or using all of these? Have you been watching videos, reading manuals, blogs, and trying to figure out everything that it takes to be a music producer? Do you have a bunch of music gear that you purchased and you still haven't made any music? Well, then you need Obedia, the world's only one-on-one -on -one digital audio training and tech support service. Check out the link below for a special new subscriber offer.